morning, everyone. I slept until like nine today, which like rarely happens. I really am a morning person, but I'm really tired. I've been working the last couple of weeks, so I slept until nine, and now I got my coffee on. Feels good. So I'm um, sitting here finishing off the last of my Blaze pizza from last night, getting my newsletter out because we had to announce the winner of the Nintendo Switch Splatoon 2 bundle. We did that on social media, but I haven't sent the email out and I'm getting all kinds of uh, questions uh, in various places. So I'm about to send that email out. You may even get one. So open it up, check it out if you haven't. Um, yeah, I got to get this out and then relax a little more today because it is an absolutely gorgeous day here in Florida. Did I mention I'm in Florida? Because I am. And I'm here with my buddy Pepper. Hey Pepper. He doesn't care. And then there's Ziggy. Say hi Ziggy. Ziggy's busy. I got the newsletter done and it's out. Uh, part of what I got to get done today before I leave for Indonesia is send this bad boy out. This is a Nintendo Switch and it is going to Josh in Leveland, Texas. And I promise you, I swear to Bob, if one more person like emails me or contacts me on social media and says that Josh isn't real, he's a real person, I've contacted him and it's legit. All right? So, could be all... I didn't win! All right, let's go mail this. All right, so this is the Nintendo Switch going out to Josh in Texas. So this is going out. I'm done here. Thank you guys very much. Appreciate it. You guys have a great day. All right, I'm done with that. On to the next set of stuff. So yay, Nintendo Switch is out of my possession. It's going to make somebody really, really happy. And it made a lot of people really angry. That's OK. I'm glad somebody won. A really fancy health food store right now. It has floating cranberries. Super fancy. Pinky's out, everyone. Pinky's out. So I've got to find somewhere here um, stuff <laughs> for the trip. I've been told to bring um, my own anti diarrheal medicine. I know it's bad when they're saying bring it. And listen, man, I don't want to go anywhere overseas where they told me to bring something like that and then I didn't. So, I'm just being real with you guys. When you go to a country, third world country, you gotta be prepared for everything. 